So, uh, I just saved the game, and uh, those three gems we got equate to more than 1% per gem, because I saved, the last save was 85%, and those three gems got us back up to, got us up to 88%, which means that each gem is like, pretty big factor in progression rate and percentage in comparison to how much the relics are. So, um, yeah, interesting, if you care about <laughs> that. So the plain ones, I haven't done the, um, oh, and that one's going to be the box gem, so that's going to be clean in the ass. Or maybe it won't be. This one will be a pain in the ass. The, the future ones are just a pain. And I can never remember why. It's one of those things where it's like, you, I have to do them to see what the problem is, and then I go, Oh, uh, yeah, and that makes it a really shit LP, because it's like, I can't remember off the top of my head, because I'm a fucking old man now. So I'm just always sitting there like, what's the issue with this? Oh, it's just fucking shitty. <laughs> like, oh, this one I have to go back and forth. Oh, this one I have to, you know what I mean? This one I have to access it through the secret warp room and go through the secret area, then backtrack to the beginning of the game, then do the rest of the game. Okay, I did that one, done that one. That's get first. It's really hard against these guys. We can give it a shot. Future Frenzy, this, yeah, this is what I'm talking about. Do the secret hard path, then go backwards, then go forwards. Yeah. Nah, man. Nah, and this one's just like fucking your face. I'm pretty sure that's how you put it in. Like, shall we try it? Shall we try it? The first one is the box gem. I've learned the code. First gem. First clear gem is box gem. Second clear gem is. Avoid the color gem goes there. I'm sorry. Yeah. You gotta have your full racing and evasion tactics up here for this thing. Good job I was playing that Ducati game. Oh, Pigs. I always forget the cops are even on this level because I'm focused on the no, 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 don't go, don't go for it. Yeah. I'll avoid using the brakes if I can get away with it. Fifth. Come on. Ah. Come here, you alien fish. It's gonna ram me with them. Smug bastard. He's getting ready. Fourth. No, I haven't been hit once so far, so... so it's tempting feet! This was six sliding. Third. Oh! You cunt! <laughs> You've ruined the playthrough. One hit. That's how hard these ones are, their secret levels don't fuck around on Crash 3. That's where the difficulty is in Crash 3, there's like this hidden peak, which is just, yeah. It's like you fuck up once and it's like, maybe you get one if it wasn't too heavy of a collision. If it is, oh you're just done. And that was the second one, so I'm basically done. It's gonna brand me again. Yeah, I am doing it now. It's all, it's all gone. It's all gone. My focus, my concentration meter has been dropped. Now not doing good damage. God damn it. We were so close. We got second. That's not bad for a first attempt. <laughs> Just fucking wrecks me in it. I tried. 
we tried hard. I feel like the thing is, if I keep trying on those, I just fuck up more and more, and I'm like, yeah, I need to just come at it with a certain mindset. Let's try. Can't believe I'm saying this. Let's try this. <laughs> it's not that hard, in theory. Because you can just shoot everything. Doesn't matter. There's a reason there's 130 boxes in this level, and it's that they just put fucking boxes everywhere, and you have to do all of this. It's a big level. Yeah, if there's one that I'm gonna like. Oh, you have to. Ah, so you know I said you could shoot it from a distance and then like save scum your way forwards if, with the, if you couldn't do a certain path. Yeah, no, they don't let you do that. Interesting. They, they have anti scum tech. The only reason that I'm not going to 100% this game, like, you know, actually 100%, because there's 100%, which is getting all of the gems in the base game. Then there's 105%, which is getting all of the other gems, and, like, Future Tense gem and all of the relics and shit. And it's like, the reason I, like, I'm probably not going to do everything in this one is literally because, uh... Ooh. Come on, there you go. You want to give it to me, really? Give it to me, baby. Sorry, I don't know what that was. Hey, I'm pretty fly. What? You send me here? How do we even get back? Can you even? You've got to be able to get back. Oh, come on, you. <laughs> I don't even know if you can get back to the first area this way, you know? But you've got to be able to. Because you can't access that area without going through this way, so... Oh, what am I doing? Don't hit the sides. You can. But it felt really like you couldn't originally. It felt really like a linear cross-off path. But otherwise, the game would be uncompletable, right? They love doing this shit. To you. They love it. They love this shit. Look, they love it. They fucking love it. Oh yeah, how was I supposed to know that that was gonna be going or not? You know? I can see this one. Look, we're just gonna deal with. Uh, the weird cigar smoking robot that I never really understood. Blue means backwards, which now means forwards. Good. Yeah. For us, anyway. Um, I don't even know. Ah, hello. In the future, they will still be using wooden crates. Ooh, please don't kill me. Like, it's like, I don't know how long it is, you know? So it's like, we're going backwards, 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 and I'm like, I don't know until we hit the beginning warp entrance of the level that we've actually got every box, so I just have to keep going backwards. I was going to do this on the way back, but I could feel future viewers screaming at me, Oh, you still got those three boxes, and then having to look ahead. Oh, well, there we go. So now, 
don't fucking die. <laughs> Which is like, it's like that whole choke thing, isn't it? It's like, don't choke. <laughs> like, now I'm going to choke. I always thought there was one crash level in this where it's like they had nitros and it was like you couldn't beat this level and get all of them without either taking a hit or um, having the gun. And like I think that was just me misremembering because there wasn't a nitro switch in that level I thought and it was like nah that was never a thing I don't think. So now just go through the game in a linear fashion, don't get killed by anything, hopefully get a checkpoint so they can't fuck me over. Shouldn't have broken that one, but like, you live and you die. You know what's really weird about Crash? He, he evolved from a four-legged marsupial and now when he crawls, he looks really awkward when he crawls, like he wasn't designed to crawl, like he's really top-heavy. And you're just like, that's real weird when you think about the the animal he came from, which is like super designed to be crawling on all fours. Um, good, I can't go back, I don't know why I would try that. Ooh. And there, we're safe. Don't have to do any of that nightmare again. Oh. I'm pretty sure I always do this with this guy, it's not even that hard to deal with it, it's just I don't, I don't want to. <laughs> oh, look at this little smug bastard. Uh, look at it. Like, I've gone up 10 lives just because this these levels require you to break so many boxes, and they're so generous with the Wumpa fruit in this game in comparison to the others. Oh, yeah, I need to do that, don't I? <laughs> That's why there's so many boxes in this one, because there's boxes every three steps. Sorry. I was just out of like, why did I mash that button? Oh, they're just handing me one put. Some of, like, this in Crash 3... There are bonus levels where, on average, you are, like, getting 130 Wumpa Fruit. And it's like, that's just a free life, plus a third of a free life. Because they just really wanted to drown you in Wumpa Fruit for some reason. Oh! We're going back. We're going back. To the block. Anyone remember that film? Because I didn't even watch it. <laughs> We're gonna do it. There's a checkpoint right there. We're gonna win. Then we don't. A lot of these is. The difference for with Crash 3 is it testing your, like, willingness to do sloggy shit. You know, rather than it, like, actually being necessarily very hard, it's just like, do you want to do this, and this, and this, and most people are like, nah, man, I can't be bothered, that's literally what's stopping you, rather than like, this is fucking hard, and it's pushing you to your absolute limit, uh, because it's so difficult, you have to be like, pixel perfect, it's not trying to do that at all, it's just going, hey, do you just want to go back and forth through the same level, like, six times, and you're like, not really, <laughs> like, so I'm not gonna, and then you're like, fuck it, I'm gonna, because I have nothing better to do with my spare time now. And that's the end of that Wumpa. Ow. Oh. oh, I've made it terrible. <laughs> I don't even need to trigger the nitro, because I was too busy blowing them up. That explosion was a lie, there was none left. That was like 15 minutes on its own nearly, well, 10 minutes. So the level length in Crash 3 is way longer, which is probably why I felt like it was actually more of a complicated and long game than 2. Because 2 is a collection of very shortish levels on average, it's not really the same length as this. Have we done this entire? Oh, we got the relic for Bye Bye Blimps. 
Na dann. Na dann. Und dann. So it's really just that relic on bye bye blimps. What are we on now? 89%. Bit weird. Some some of the gems got me 2%, some of the gems get me 1%. I guess it's 1.5. Whatever. This is the box gem. Should we make this one future themed? So, yeah. Could do that. Ah. Uh, he's juggling the one to three R. I don't get how they're purple on the inside. They don't give any indication that they're gonna have purple juice on the inside of fruits. So we start at the beginning. So that should be good, right? The horrible future where Cortex becomes Jeff Bezos. Time for more Bezos propaganda. Fuck Bezos. There we go. That was your daily Bezos. Oh yeah, I was trying, I was considering to talking more about Satanism on my channel as, you know, I'm kind of into modern Satanism and I study a lot of the, the, uh, theologies, theology of various religions and stuff. And I thought, oh yeah, I could just start because one of my friends started talking about how he's satanic and immediately got loads of like Catholic spammers going, oh, God will save you, and all this usual tripe. And you're just like, yeah, whatever, you supremacist dipshit. And you're just like, um, yeah, I'm way more intolerant towards Christians because, yeah, I'm an asshole. Um, oh, we have to go back. They do this, don't they? I forgot about this. Can I hear it from here? Gimme. I can. Awesome. So I thought, you know, anything to get myself some publicity from people who aren't bot boob lady people are getting a lot of that lately. You know, girls with boobies in their images. I get this on Instagram too, because who doesn't? Um, uh, at this point. You know, they work out your gender and then they start sending you things going, Hey, do you want to see me naked? And you're like, uh, you know, porn is free, right? And they're like, hey. And you're like, okay, what am I missing here? I need this. I'm missing something. There is something. The environment is a lot of metallic. So I'm checking that I'm not missing a switch box. I'm not gonna stand on this. I fucked up. I done goofed. Just go back a little bit. Jesus. There's something I'm missing. Mm, nothing above it. Unless it's something above it that I can't see quite now. Quite now. Yeah, and you know, anything to like, there's nothing above it, yeah, uh, anything to like, get attention, I guess, and be an asshole. I will be the, oh, <laughs> well, that's what I get. Uh, I will be the satanic YouTuber who plays Crash Bandicoot games. Where is the switch box? If, they, if it's like, oh, the switch box is in another part of the level entirely and you have to backtrack all the way, I'm going to be like, oh, it's like, it's at the beginning and you just missed it. Mm. What am I not seeing? Oh, yeah, back means forward. Not like I'm gonna run out of. Oh, I will at that rate. Uh, what am I not seeing here? There is a switch. I am missing the switch. Hmm. Front to back, back to front. Here we go, here we go. It's gonna be a white trash millionaire. Uh, yeah, so I thought I could just make everything about Satanism so that I could get loads of like hate from Catholics because, you know, nothing draws other people in than like being pissing off the Christian community. It's like, oh, you know. 
just need to see the phrase bloody jewels carved into the backs of innocents. And you're like, oh, yeah, you, know, you don't need to care about what these morons believe. Because, <laughs> yeah. It's like, I believe in Sol Invictus. <laughs> no, not really. Although that would be hype as fuck. Christians are literally, like, Christianity is one of the first that really just did the whole, we're just gonna whitewash every other religion out of existence and fuck you, <laughs> you know? They were really the first that kind of pushed that shite, or the first that, where it's like, still to this day, people are like, what do you mean, this day? And you're like, uh, yeah, Christmas is not Christmas, it's like, several other religions is winter festival day that they just kind of were like yeah man fuck you you know maybe i have to break uh, switch the switch boxes in a certain order or something i am missing something horribly here which is probably why i'm not getting this entirely you know Maybe these are got a dead man switch on them. These never alive robots. Yeah, it's like actually sold in Victus's day. Uh, the unconquerable sun, which is the old. Uh, I need that trampoline box if I'm gonna do this. Where are you? We'll see if I can. Like, this is an experiment. If I can take this to go backwards then there could be a switch box further in the level that I need to hit and then walk all the way back for. Oh, it fades out. Oh, and I've just hit the checkpoint. And now it's gone entirely. Huh. Okay. That's something I'm gonna have to look up. Uh, how fast can I speed run this level? Mm -hmm. Ooh! Good job, he was. It's like when you're running red lights. <laughs> ah! I see. Ah, this would have fucked me over too. Ah! Uh, ooh! I'm trying. Ooh. Oh, there's just a lot of shit in this level. It's got less than Future Frenzy, but it's still got quite a lot of stuff that you gotta do, you know? Uh, what? <laughs> okay. Didn't know you could even hit the sides of those, but okay. Well, that they set your ass on fire. You're just kind of monkeying around. So there's a lot of like paths and stuff, whether or not they all have shit in them. Oh. So I can see what the problem is. There's a lot of switch boxes that I'm not seeing or I can't hit or I'm doing something wrong about. So it is what it is. Because there was also some in that in that one where I didn't see where the switch box was. So it's a pretty short level, it's just got a lot of weird hidden switches. Sorry, that was a bit boring. Yeah, it's also 25th is like around the time that like a lot of pagan festivals existed for like um, like Nordic winter feasts and the Christians came along and said, oh, it's got to be more chaste and less fun. And eh, that's also why Friday the 13th is considered unlucky because it used to be Freya's day and Freya's it used to say, hey man, I'm the goddess of nature and fertility. All go out and fuck each other. And all of the Norse pagans are like, yeah, today is fuck day. <laughs> and the Christians are like, this is most uncouth. It's like, oh, who, who asked you, you fucking trite-ass pieces of shit? Like, <laughs> you know? Oh, I'm sorry. Let's take basic bodily functions of the human, uh, the human kind, the human kind, and just 
demonize them as if like that, you know, makes us closer to God for going, oh, we're disgusting because we have to poop and have sex. <laughs> like, oh no. Christians are the kind of people who would love to be droids, is what I'm saying. Christians are the kind of people who are like, oh, oh, I just gotta kill these as fast as possible. Let's go. Let's -a go. Let's -a kill the blimp. Oh no, I've done them in the wrong order. I'm sorry, I sound incredibly racist to Italians. I'm trying to do Mario. <laughs> I'm starting to sound Welsh. <laughs> Do it, 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 do it. Hey, I could have hit it by now. Look at this shit, it's going through the blimp. Bye bye, blimp. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, this is bullshit, come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's, that's a good time. I feel like that's a good time. Yeah, it was a good time. And it's good. You know what it's time for? Mwah. I don't know, I'm having a fun time. Yeah, so the the thing that annoys me about Christians is like everyone thinks of them as like this, like and it's just like they're, they're, you know, it's like every religion, it's got a load of misguided cults, it's got a load of bullshit. It's not a human sacrifice that they then call Satanism and cover up. And it's actually Satan. The Satanism is one of the only cults where people have not died. <laughs> but you listen to Christians, every fanatical Christian cult that goes out murdering people in the name of God then gets like, oh, no, they're satanic. It's like, nah, I'm pretty sure they're just misguided lunatics that were listening to your weirdness. So. Yeah. Strong. Now, like I said in my Crash Team Racing LP, don't burn the churches without consent. That's my stance. Now, what you call consent is up to you, and I'm not going to judge, but don't burn the churches without consent, because that's still arson, <laughs> you know? Or, as arson fanatics call it, it's just a bit of arson about eh? oh it's this one we got these we got these oh this is the this is the bullshit we're at 90% that's pretty good right we're all happy with that we're all happy with that I'm not happy with that <laughs> This is where someone goes, actually, the tech is that you, like, play as Coco because her plane's fast, and I'm going to be like, oh, little. Oh, yeah, if you spin, you get a speed boost, but then I can't aim. Look at this. I'm full lock left and right here. It's inverted. Oh, my God, I just noticed. Oh, <laughs> how am I not dead? You can do it. You just gotta, just gotta angle it. Just make it a bit. Whoa, that's too wide. That's all. Oh, that inversion is actually making me. But like in all, in all the others, it's not making me. So it's like, I guess I'm not looking for accuracy when I'm shooting stuff down there. So how can I explain how this handles? It's a bit hammy. <laughs> if that makes sense. It handles like it's made of ham. Like, the plane is handling like it's ham. Like, look, it's just very hammy. I don't know what to tell you. It's just very hammy. Are we enjoying ourselves? Is this fun? Yeah, just... just I, I'm going to stop in a minute. Just let this sink in. <laughs> let this sink in. Let that sink in. The turning circle is wider than the hoop, and you're having to go out and figure eight back on yourself to get the hoop. Now, obviously, I can get the box gem by going as slow as possible and just hitting the hoops and the boxes, but the accuracy required is not what 
the plane can do, and that is actually pissing me off a little bit. Because it's not even that this game didn't get it right, it's just it feels hammy, as I said. It feels like, you know, if you press a break and it doesn't really do anything and it just feels a bit squishy, it's a bit hammy. Oh, I haven't done any of these. Have I not done any of these? What do I have to do? Okay. I hear you. What do I have to do? Why isn't there? With some of these secret levels, speed running them before getting any of the gems is super viable because the gems are like, hey, just get all of these fucking boxes. Oh yeah, this shit. I forgot about that. You know? Oh, I thought these were the, the wobbles. They're like the wobbles. I call them the wobbles. Oh. Oh. It's okay. Cool story, bro. Yeah, wiggle your wiggle that tush. Ah. Uh, Good job I got that checkpoint. Uh, yeah, like, uh, some of these, you kind of feel, oh, well that's, that's close enough. Some of these you feel like, oh, pfft, I pressed X twice. Fucking, look at this little shit thing. Are you kidding me? Why is this an asset that never appeared? They, they made a whole asset for a bit of the game where it's just like, it just wants to fuck with you. Look at this. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, don't want to just dunk on Christians entirely though. I, I know I can be very negative towards Christians. I've met some really great Christians who are really nice people, but like, oh. <laughs> I met some, yeah, like like everything, it's like you meet some decent people and you meet some utter fucking bigots who seem to think that they have the right. And it's like, nothing gives you the right. People gotta understand this, doesn't matter who you are, you don't get the fucking right to tell me how to live my fucking life. It's really simple. I can do it. You just, just run and don't think about it. Ooh. My little bastard. Oh, good. This is what I wanted. I fucking wanted! <laughs> Can't even do the death route because I kept dying. <laughs> Look at this! Look at this! Look at this! Look at this! Can't even do the death route. Don't even know what I'm doing at this point. Don't even know where the gems are. I'm just kind of going, just trying to explore. Really, oh, that's a bit of a shit move, isn't it? What the fuck is it? Is it? Please, thank you. And there's all these switch boxes, which is a problem I was having with Gone Tomorrow. Didn't feel like I was going to get that. Oh. Oh. Can't even iframe my way through it. I just don't understand, because this is this didn't ship with the original release. Much like... Uh, there are boxes over there, out of vision. Oh, they're in the mirror! <laughs> yeah, no. Oh! Go wait for him to throw his shoes in the air. Go wait for him to spawn in. There, there you go. Yeah, that, 
So I, that's the least experience I have. It's hard. I don't even know what the target time is. It'll be some bullshit. 201. I could do that, but I'm not gonna. You know I can. There's a lot of stuff. But we've done quite a lot of progress. We got from 83% to like 90. So I'm happy with that. This is the box gem. We're just gonna... This is running a bit late. Okay, we'll start a new one, and I'm gonna try the box gym of this, and then a few motorbike levels. Hey, we've almost got to the 100% mark. Once we get all of the gems, uh, that's that's a very interesting question. Do they count? the Future Tense gems, because before Future Tense didn't have, didn't exist. I'm kind of worried that they'll say, you need to get all of the gems, and it's like, hey, those gems shouldn't count because they're not part of the original collection of gems. But I understand at the same time if they do now count, you know, so I'm kind of confused because it might stop us from getting the special ending of Crash 3, the 100% ending, because uh, technically you need to collect all gems, and I don't have all gems, because future tense is hard. Well, well, you know, we can always get to that when we get to it. Anyway, we'll start a new sesh. Sush. <laughs>